And here at Baylor, we have so many different uh, clinical practices that we're exposed to from day one. Um, and then the patient diversity is in the medical center is supreme, you know, it's, it's as good as it gets. Um, so in my first four months of residency, I was exposed to every different clinical environment. So I was at the VA here in Houston, one of the world's largest VAs. I was at our public hospital, I was at the private hospital, and then later on the road we'll be at the you know, Cancer Institute here uh, in the medical center. So that was truly wonderful. I think Baylor is unique in that it, it offers a high complexity VA medical center with a tertiary uh, academic medical center with uh, one of the busiest penetrating and blunt tra um, trauma centers in the country with leaders in the field across the spectrum of those sites. We spend a substantial portion of our time at Texas Children's Hospital, one of the best children's hospitals in the country, where we're gonna work with world leaders in their respective fields and just get a bunch of cases that you need to do as a laparoscopic surgeon to get your skills up to speed. And so you get to have that balance where you have true exposure to world-class care and also get to have the chance to have some guided autonomy where you can try, try out some of the practice that you've learned and honed in over the years and you can truly put that to work on some patients that really need it. So I think when I was applying and when I was making my rank list, that's what I was thinking about when I was ranking Baylor College of Medicine. And I think it has done nothing but meet and exceed those expectations and I think a Baylor general surgery trained resident is going to be among the best trained surgery residents in the country because of it.